Hey guys, what is going on? IGFC 101 here yet again bringing you something very, very different. You may not have known, but I recently purchased an HD PVR and this is some Magic 2012 gameplay. I don't want to keep this hand. This hand I think is much better. It's got a blood ghast, which you don't know if you get is um, when you get that full, you get it back. And it's got a kill card, so I'm happy with that. My, um, my opponent is playing the Unquenchable Fire deck. So, um, no, 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 I changed to Ancient Realms, that's right. Ancient Depths, sorry. <laughs> ancient Depths. Uh, hopefully, I can get a nice quick start because everyone knows how um, it's hard to beat Ancient Depths in the long run. In fact, it's pretty much impossible. So, hopefully. I'll be able to beat him in the lot in the short term. He's probably going to have a coil and arc here now. He missed the mana ramp on turn two. That is brilliant for me. Don't need, can't use my kill card yet, so I'll just swing in. But yeah, this is Magic 2012. I'm, I'm a huge fan of this game. I've been playing it for a few months now. I found it because of the whole Onslaught Hutch um, Dunkus APL Fisher series back a few months ago. But now I'm subscribed to people like WMG and Daisho. I'm a huge fan of Daisho. Uh, he's pretty much the only person on YouTube who can watch every single one of his videos. So I thought I'd get. So now I've got a PVR. That is the So I've got two of these lifelink cards. I can bring one of them in this turn. So that'll be a 4 4 because that's got Bloodthirst. So that'll be pretty beast. He did get the man round that turn. We got Cultivate. But I'm not sure if you guys would be interested in magic, but it's something I definitely want to be posting on my channel. So if you enjoy it, let me know. If you don't, let me know, but I'm still going to be posting it. Because <laughs> it's a game I really enjoy. It's probably my favourite game at the minute. I'm tired of cards. Okay, that card gets him more land. 2 4, and he gets to play some land. So. It's not really a problem with what I've got. He can, he can decide to block it next turn and I'll kill him. That is up to him. I'm going to get another one out this turn. Like, now he does two damage, so we'll have to see what goes on here. I'm going to swing in with both creatures because Bloodcast can't block, so there's no point. And then if he wants to try and kill, if he wants to block that, he's going to have to kill his creature, which is fine. And then he's going to get another one of them guys out. This might not be the first Magic gameplay I'm going to post on my channel, but it's definitely the first I'm recording. So that's why I'm just saying about the intro, he's got seven land out. If you didn't know, if you're new to Magic, you need seven of these lands out to pay your cards. You need, and that's how you pay for your cards. If you look at the top, top right of the card, you how much money you need to pay your card, play your card. This one would need two. So um, that's how I do that. That's how you play cards. He's played the 3-3 Octopus here, and he's got a 2-2, that's a pretty good card, I'm not going to lie, I'm probably going to kill that. And with, um, I can't even remember the name of this card, this is Hunger, so I'm going to do that now. Let's get that away. I'm not going to play the land yet, because if you don't know, if he kills the card, I can just get him back. He can't kill any of my creatures, which is fantastic. He'll probably block one, but yeah, I don't mind that. He goes down to eight, and this game in life for days. I'm literally on 34 life. So this game is pretty much over. That's the thing you need to do against Ancient Depths. You need to just get the get the good start. And then they're pretty much done. I mean, he didn't really stand a chance here. Because I was able to kill all his creatures. He's going to take all my creatures now. He's going to take Sagramancer, but that doesn't matter, I don't think. That becomes a 5 5 flyer, so there's a good cut, there's a good draw for him. Um, that is a good card for me, so yeah, that's fine for me. I can just kill that, I don't mind killing my own creature. Normally, you don't want to really kill your own creature, but I don't mind doing that, because now I can just swing in and win the game. So that's the first episode of Magic, I managed to get a pretty simple win here, hope you enjoyed this guys and I'll see you guys in the next Magic video, later guys.